Welcome back everyone to tutorial number 20. Now in ES 2015, we have a new for off statement and this is kind of a for loop, but it is used to loop over iterables. Now we will learn about iterables later on in the video series, but for now, let us see how to use the for off loop with arrays and strings. So I'm going to start off by creating a simple array, let colors is equal to, let's say red, and then blue and then green. Now normally what we would do is we would use for loop and say let index in colors then we would say log colors of index. So let's save this. So we have red, blue and green. But now let's have a look at the for of statement. So for now let color of colors, I'm going to log color. So let's save this. And there you go, red, blue, green, red, blue, green. So with the help of for of loop, we can read the element directly with lesser code. So we don't have to have an index and then use the index on the colors array. Each time we get a value from this colors array, store it into color by using the for of loop and then we can just log it onto the console. So that's how we work with arrays using for of loops. Now let's consider a string. Let letters is equal to abc. And then we can do a for of loop. So let letter of letters and we can log letter. So when you use for of loop on a string, it is going to pick each character at a time and assign it to this letter. So A is going to be logged, then B and then C. So let's have a look, A, B and C. So that's pretty much it, how you use the for of loop with an array and then a string. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.